Hey, it's Regimus Maximus, and I'm back once again. Today, we are checking out the power of the primes, hunger. Are you hungry? Get ready. Regimus Maximus Alright, today we are checking out the power of the primes, hunger. Hungar. I don't know how you want to say it, but let's take a quick look at the box. You've got a picture of Hungar right there. For once, you actually got him in its beast mode. I don't know if I've seen, well, the Dinobots. Yeah, I've seen the Dinobots there in their beast modes. All right, there's Hungar. It's the front of the box. Let me take it back a little bit. The side of the box, it's got Abominus on there. Can't wait for Abominus. And we have the back of the box. And of course, the sign, it's got the Prime logos on there, so. Alright. So we are done with the box. So we have Hungar. And Hungar don't look bad. He don't look bad at all. I mean, compared to the G1 version, I do have the G1 version. Let's go ahead and check out his articulation. His neck. Slash legs can move. His mouth can snap. So watch out, he might bite. Um, his back legs do move. Nice little ratchet right there. So, his little legs right here. They'll move. All right, right here we have Hunger beside his G1 counterpart, his daddy, the original Hunger. I mean, and in this version, his mouth did not open. Um, transformation is pretty much about the same, almost. So, I mean, it's just a basic setup. So, you see, like the top of him right here, and the top of him right here. Let's just put them on their sides. So you can both see how both of them are at that stage. But they made a real good improvement on him, I think. So his eyes went from green to pink. So, but not bad. Hungar does come with his prime armor, aka his Obama feet. And he's got his little prime pack or whatever you want to call it in there. So, let's get to transforming Hunger. We're going to take these off. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take his feet, close his mouth on these, close these, and we're going to take these up, take these right here, and you're going to raise these up right into here. like that and then we're gonna bring these around bring these right here around rotate this this way and bring that around like so straighten him up we'll take his tail on the old one his tail went back behind him this one goes right here in front of him and you yeah, open him up like so there we go so his head is 
about the articulation. Um, this articulation on his head, on his feet, can move backwards and forwards like that. It's something I think you probably need to know. Now let's get to transforming his feet. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this and raise it up here, up here like that. Take this and raise it up. And you do it to both sides. And here we have Hunger all transformed. So let's take a look at the back. Maybe I should fold his arms up. He's not a bad looking figure. I mean, the back, you know, you pretty much know what it's going to be. The legs kind of hollow. And here he is next to his G1 counterpart. Okie dokie. See? Alright, let's check out his articulation. So his legs can move. He can do a knee. Um, they can go backwards, forwards, sideways. The ankles do have a tilt. Um, his arms go out sideways. His hands are fixed in that position. They had his prime armor on the side of his arm, so um, his waist can't move. His head can. So. Oh no. Not bad. Not a bad figure. I think he's okay. All thing is, I mean, I think they could have color his face a different color. But beyond that, not bad. Um, I will be f forming Obaminus when I get all the pieces. So look forward to that. But until then, this is Regimus Maximus. And once again, I am out.